You enjoying your pie? All pie is good pie. So, am I the right guy to eliminate your problem? Am I the right guy to eliminate your problem? The first teaser trailer for Hitman, starring Glenn Powell, is here. The film was directed by Richard Linklater and co-written by Linklater and Powell. You enjoying your pie? All pie is good pie. The movie's official description reads, Inspired by an unbelievable true story, a straight-laced professor discovers his hidden talent as a fake hitman. He meets his match in a client who steals his heart and ignites a powder keg of deception, delight, and mixed-up identities. Netflix is giving the film a limited theatrical release on June 7th and also dropping it on streaming on the same day. Hitman gained attention at the Venice Film Festival in September and just screened at the Sundance Film Festival. Powell and Link later stopped by the Hollywood Reporter Studio in Park City and spoke about filming the project in New Orleans. We were looking at different places to shoot this and, you know, Louisiana and New Orleans really stepped up and New Orleans is just such a yeah. quilt of culture and, you know, with all the, you know, parishes and, and the difference in people, like you really have like such a vibrant color to that place that makes it really interesting. With an undercurrent of like lawlessness, <laughs> yeah. you know, that it's a little bit of anarchy in the streets, you know, kind of vibe, which fits this movie perfectly. Would there really be these people out there who wanted to, you know, bump off a loved one or form a loved one? It's like, yeah, New Orleans kind of has that little vibe in a, in a good way. You can watch the full interview on our YouTube channel or THR.com. This is the Hollywood Reporter News. You're a very hard man to find. No address, phone, office. Tom, please stop. Tom Ripley. Tom Ripley? Thomas Ripley. I like the name. Tom what? Ripley. on Netflix of 2023. This apocalyptic psychological thriller relied on excellent direction and exceptional performances. A very intriguing and compelling mystery with great performances that people really slept on. A very inspiring story about a person with resilience with great performances by Annette Bening and Jodie Foster. This sequel doubled down on everything that made the first one work while giving us a larger scale and some incredibly brutal action. Coleman D'Amico delivers an award-winning performance in this both upbeat and inspiring story and highlights the unsung heroes during the peaceful march of 1960. Love the animation and the world building with this Blade Runner meets medieval background. A very simple and straightforward noir thriller story that you've seen before, but it's well polished with David Fincher's meticulous approach. I love this movie. It's Jordan Peele's Get Out meets Donald Glover's Atlanta. One of the best survival movies I've ever seen, period. A film about obsession and control complemented with excellent direction by Todd Haynes. So there you have it. That's my top 10 list of Netflix films of 2023. Now it's your turn to share yours in the comments below.